What is up, folks? And Mikey at 31 here, NCA 14 Dynasty, Idaho Vandals Dynasty, episode number two. Week one, we barely beat the North Texas Mean Green. Now we have another road game against the Wyoming Cowboys. Yeah, this team, yeah, they're not great. <laughs> but we squeaked out a W week one. Let's take a look at the uh, Wyoming Cowboys, see what they do have. From the Mountain West, got a mobile quarterback, redshirt freshman Sean Chambers. Got decent speed, throw power and throwing accuracy here, nothing to write home about. Got a couple of decent backs, you know, for the level of play that they have. Some scooters at wide receiver. Really? I'm getting old, man. Rocket Ismail Jr., huh? Really? That's a sign of just age. <laughs> My boy Rocket. I grew up wanting to be Rocket Ismail. But anyway, that's fascinating. Decent tight end. Let's see their offensive line. It's, you know, average across the board. Good center. Really good center, actually. Defensively. Josiah Hall. How good are you? Eh, average. Don't see anyone really here game-breaking so far. This guy's a pretty good athlete. Pretty speedy backer there. Logan Wilson, 89 overall. 87 tackle, 85 hit power. 80 block shed, can blitz a little bit and rush the passer. Decent zone coverage, decent man coverage. Not bad, another good zone coverage backer here. And Cash Malua. Defensive backfield, got a couple of good corners. And safeties are okay. So they got some decent pieces for being a Mountain West team. And again, you got to factor in um, quality of competition with these teams as far as the conference they're playing in. When you're Idaho, you're going to be outgunned more often than not. Let's go. They're 75 overall, we're 63 overall. We're in 335 stack on D. And the Oregon offense on O. Hi everybody, Reese Davis with you, bringing you the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 free game show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. Laramie, Wyoming, War Memorial Stadium. Pretty sparse crowd. before our showdown today. Everybody making sure everything includes. You better be ready for this highly intense, fast-paced game we're expecting today. Thanks for joining us here on the NCAA College Football pregame show. Now let's send it out to Brad and Kirk for all the action. We'll see you at the half.
Stadium, located in Laramie, Wyoming. It's time for the coin toss now, presented by Coke Zero. Real Coke taste, zero calories. Enjoy everything. All righty, let's go. Idaho is getting fired up down there as they get ready to boot this opening kickoff. He just drills this one. He's to the 20, at the 30, and he's taken down at the 33. Right, on D against the CPU, we control on the on the defensive line. It's it's the best way I feel to get ratings on ratings re respected against the CPU. As opposed to you being a linebacker or a safety. I mean, what's the joy in lurking a machine? All right, third down. Let's go. And away he goes. I'm telling you, quarterbacks. Wow. Dotton right over the middle. Oh boy. So Xavier Valade, that's a heck of a name. Alright, come on. On second down. There we go. Get downhill, baby. All right, come on, let's go. Hold the door. And there we go. Wonder if they'll go for it though. To the defense for reading that one and making a sensational field goal. Kick us up. It's good. All right, we hold. Oh, jeez. Oh. Well, I won't be a big play out of that. Not a bad return, considering. Hang on, or don't. Whoop. Uh, just enough athleticism to be respectable. Not a burner by any stretch. Wow. <laughs> Horrible throw. Made him reach back for it. Oh, jeez. He got detonated. Gets to about the 47 yard line. Had a nice cutback lane, though. Look at that. And down he goes. Okay. Just wish we had some explosiveness on this team, but alas. Chill out a little bit. Reset. Ah, catch the ball. Oh. Go, 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 go. Okay. Come on, get there. We're going to go for this. Tempo and go for it. Oh, 
Ah, man, if you were faster, we could house that. Go, 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 go. Great blocking. And Jonte Boston houses that. Wow, that was perfect. And did that play ever develop nicely? Well, it certainly did. Beat his man off the line and then ran a perfect route. All he had to do after that was make the catch. Let's check in with Reese Davis in the studio. Off to LA we go. There was never any room to breathe. You know, Washington State off to a tough start, huh? Back to our game. Ah, crap. Come on. Get him, guys. Jesus. All right. Come on. Well, they're going to run it. And come on. Hold him up. Damn it. So that three-yard scamper by the halfback is good for the first down. For the Jesus. All right, going to have to send guys downhill, looks like. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on. There we go. Charles Akano, good pursuit there. Jeez. Right around the 32 yard line. Ah, uh, all right, there we go. Got him before we can get going. That'll make it 39. Kick is up. Does it have enough? It does. The boot. All right, come on. All right, hang on. Tough catch. Let's see what we got here. Stop and pop. Get the third and manageable. Way speed. Da -da, da 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 Life would be so simple. That'll make it second and inches. Let's go. This happens. At about the 17 yard All right, reset. The dang receiver goes into the tight end spot, and he can, <laughs> and he's a play where he has to hold up and, and blocking, and he gets destroyed. Drive. Two down territory here. We won't need it. And we might house it. No, not quite. This kind of execution from an offense. Khalil Forehand comes in for a first carry of the game. 
on a third down. This defense got All right, let's go. Let's go, gents. Lyman hopes for an opportunity to impose his will on the defense. All right, keep it up, D. We're bending but not breaking. This game can be drastically changed on just one or two plays, and they got him for a loss. Well, I think it's safe to say the defense had his number on that one. It can be very frustrating for a running back when he stops before he even gets going. Ah, make the tackle, man. Jeez. There we go. This quarterback has to do a better job of avoiding the rush. Rashawn Crawford gets him. Ah, damn it. Nice, 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 nice. Good job, fellas. Let's go. Let's go. Pick up as they connect on the pass play. Well, they look to be in sync right now. They're both reading the defense properly, and the result is a nice game. Idaho holds an eight point advantage. That should be good. Let's go. Ring it up. Mason Petrino sharp in the first half. Keep an eye for this guy. They love going to him down here. All right, nothing crazy now. This is before the half. He's scrambling. Uh, you want to tackle him? You just sat there and watched him run right by you. You dope. That was a great play call. But what was even better was how he finished the run. Got out of bounds to stop the clock. Number 28, you moron. Jeez. Another run. Yeah, they're kind of helping me out now. It's a great play by the defense, but you know it really makes you wonder, was there a miscommunication up front by the offensive line? They just seemed to allow the defensive line to get through, and the running back didn't have much of a chance at all. Let's go. Yeah, they did not manage that series of downs very well at all. Kick is up. It's good. Wow. And I try to get aggressive, and that's what happens. Jesus. What was most impressive is how he followed the play, and he just didn't give up on it. It was that effort that allowed him to come away with the fumble.
They're going to review this fumble, and I've got to tell you, I think he was down before the ball. Popped. I hope so. They called it a fumble on the field, and they need industry. Yeah, he's down. After review the play, the ruling on the field is reversed. Well, after seeing the replay, it was apparent that his knee was down. And on that note, we'll go right to the half. We played 30 minutes. Glad to have you with us on the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. David Pollock and I here in the studio to break down everything that just happened in your game. Perhaps the most important statistic in any football game is turnover margin. I once had a wise coach tell me that the football was so important they named the game after it. Whatever that means. I think it means that you're not supposed to let it get away from you and give it to the other team. And so far, both of these offenses have done a great job of that. No doubt. And most games are lost, not won. And, and it's because of the turnover differential. And you can look at the stats when you say that every single time. But, you know, both teams doing a good job taking care of it. Both offenses executing and still calling a game, still, still scoring points, still putting up good numbers. But at the same time, taking care of the pigskin. And... They better value that thing because, yeah, you give it away and bad things happen. That'll do it here in the studio at halftime. We'll try to see if Pollock can bring a little energy in the second half. Got a lot of games to watch, including yours. Brad and Kirk ready for the second half. Well, let's keep on going. And he's taken down at the 36-yard line. Uncovered slot should work. Fires out to his wide out. We're so slow. <laughs> there we go. There we go. Why aren't you faster? <laughs> Good Lord Almighty. Coaches love to see. Right now they're firing on all cylinders. Ooh, who's hurt? Dude just carried the ball. He's gonna try and go, 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 After that was make the catch. Wasting drives if they want to get Let's keep going, defense. Let's go. Send both safeties off the edge. That's a little tackle, just lets them go. <laughs> Come on. Oh my god. He's in the open field. Tackle made at the 16 yard line. What a huge letdown by the defense on a big third down play. And that is just inexcusable. That's not good. Ah. Uh... Jeez. All right. And they respond. No one could break clear, so the QB decided to run it in. You've got to like when you your things into his own hands. Oh. That's square. 
No, 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 no. They knock it out. Way to fight. Whoops. Alright, good job. That was kind of disorienting. Ooh, come on, heck, don't fumble. Don't fumble. Alright, to the fourth we go. Oh, what's this? Oh, that's a killer. Oh, my God, he jumped that? Really? Oh, my Lord. Jeez. Nah, there was room. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. Damn it. All right, well, we're holding them to field goals and we have to do it. That's been the difference in the game. We're going to go for it here. Makes sense. Let's go. No one's open. Let's go. Well, yeah, I had a guy open, but I had a spy and a um, robber there. A coverage that does not in Madden add up the dollar anymore. Where you have, never mind. I won't go there. Right, let's go. Let's go. Yes. Damn it. Got him, got him, got him, got him, got him. Big play. These guys know and trust each other, and you could see it in the way he threw that pass. Mason Petrino slinging today. Had some accuracy issues in the opener. He's playing. All right, let's put this bad boy away. <laughs> and now he goes inaccurate. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, my God. Someone got smoked. All right, fourth and inches. Don't want to sell out here. There's no need to. I want to make them. I'm exchanging yardage for time. Now he tries to buy some time. Tick tock, tick tock, tick tock. Wow, you're gonna let him truck you like that? Jeez. Man, and they 
All right, come on. Well, you can run all you want, buddy. I'm not really concerned about that. That clock keeps on moving. Let's go. Let's go. Nate DeGraw, whoever you are. Gotten some big sacks in timely situations. Damn it, I missed him. <laughs> but no one's open. They're going to turn the ball over on downs. Damn it. Oh, almost, almost. He's at 100 yards rushing for the day. Uh, pick it off and end the game, please. If you get this quarterback set and throw, he'll kill you all game. But they got excellent pressure on that play. No, 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 no. The 21 yard line. No, ooh, paid the price. The spike will stop the clock. No, 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 no. Good job. Corners are playing well, boy. Damn it. Bad play call. That's that screws them over. Are they gonna be able to get a playoff? Yes they are. There we go. Let's go. Way to close it out, defense. Great job. Defense stood tall that game, man. Mason Petrino gets player of the game. Three touchdowns. This play right here was beautiful. All right, your Idaho Vandals go to two and O. Oh. Mason Petrino, seventeen and twenty-four for a buck eighty-six, three TDs, one INT. Kian Martinez, and he's a true freshman, twenty-one carries, a buck oh three, and a touchdown. Khalil Forehand is a redshirt freshman. 6.6 6 yards per pop, and Petrino added 16 yards rushing. Nothing, you know, major. Jante Boston, two TDs. Jeff Cotton, a TD. Christian Ellis, 11 solo tackles, 12 tackles total. 
and two tackles for loss. Noah Ellis had three tackles for loss and two sacks. Tyrese Deadman had a sack. Nate McGraw. Or Sean Crawford. Five sacks in the day. Those are those are very big. Total yards pretty even, 344 to 325. The um, big number here, six trips to the red zone for them, and um, they had to settle for field goals. That was the game, really. Pretty even otherwise. So there you go. That is that for episode two of your Idaho Vandals NCAA 14 Dynasty. Hope you guys enjoy. I'll talk to you all later. Peace.